our curry. Um, and it is not spicy at all. It has enough red curry paste in it to change it a different color and to get a tiny, tiny bit of the flavor. And it's something the whole family can eat. Right? Um, but it, ta it has um, cauliflower, bell peppers, um, coconut milk, some red curry paste, um, and then the um, vegetables like garlic, onion. Uh, I think that's it. So let's try this, Mal. When you're done your fruit, of course. Oh, okay. Do you want to try your spoon? I do have a fork for you. He loves using his fork these days. And then he hands it back so I can put it on. And he's also been taking attempts at stabbing his own food. And sometimes he's successful. Do you want to try a fork for this curry? You can. Try your fork. Fork. Here's a chickpea. <laughs> so he's had cauliflower, he's had bell peppers, he's had chickpea, and he's had coconut milk. I'm gonna try the spoon. But he's never had the red curry paste and he hasn't had them all in combination. Water. <laughs> oh, and this is olives. These are one of his new favorites. They're just chopped olives. Oh! <laughs> it went on the floor. Here you go. This one's a lot harder because it's a tiny bit soupy. No? I'll leave it here for you. Can I help you? Can I help you? You could go a little slower. So, I think you like it. Seems like you like it. Maybe not as much as you love those olives. <laughs> Wanna take one more bite? Is it easier to use your hands when it's a little soupy? Yeah, that takes skill. Do you wanna say bye-bye? Bye-bye, I'm going to finish now. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.